What's up guys, Beat Up coming at you here with another video. And today's video is going to be for those of you folks who strictly own the Nissan 370Z. And sorry that little dog, not little, but big, bigger dog has to be barking the minute I start recording. It's like, no baby love, you don't need to bark, honey. <laughs> but anyways, guys, this is going to be about um, how to change your analog clock up here on your tack for those of you folks who own the Nissan 370Z. So um, a little bit about this. First of all, I do want to point out in your settings, there is also a secondary clock. So if we go up here to settings, go to clock, there's also a clock you could do that's like an on-screen clock like this if you'd like. I personally don't care to have one clock here and then another clock here. That just doesn't make much sense to me, especially with your tack clock over there. That's not something that you can go ahead and change anyways. So there's no point of having two clocks there in my way. Prior owner had it set up that way and I just don't really care. So that's a little bit about how you can go in and change your clock on screen if you want. Now this one over here, even if you have daylight savings time set on your settings, as you just saw a second ago in this section, it will not switch this. You have to constantly do this manually. So to go ahead and do it manually, folks, what you Weather want to alert. do... Weather alert. Winter storm warning in about 15 oh, miles great. from current location. Okay, 15 miles away. We're not going anywhere near there. Okay. <laughs> Jeez, girl. Okay, thanks for letting me know. It's 57 degrees out yet. There's a freaking winter storm warning. Come on. I'm in Oregon, not Michigan. Okay, so let's go. So there's this little square that you're going to want to click that's like pages. You want to click this till you get to this button right here. Or not button, excuse me, menu. Then you want to click this little circle. You click the circle. Click the circle again. Then you want to click this pages. So we're on clock, you see? Okay, then you want to click on the circle to go to setting. Then you want to click on pages. And this is how you change. You go up to change your time like this. You go up. That will change your hour. Let me just do this for an example. It's very kind of a slow process. Then you click the square to go over. Then you do the same thing here to change your minute. But we're already set with that. And then you click enter, enter, enter. And there we go. And there you have it, folks. That's how you change your tack clock for the Nissan 370Z. Somewhat like the Nissan 350Z. Um, not that much different, honestly. But let me go back into this mode real quick while we're at it. We'll go to clock. And then as you can see, we do have our daylight savings time set to on. And then we have our hour, minute. This stuff here, you guys, has nothing to do with the clock up here. It's strictly talking about if you have this one on. See? That's what it's talking about, is that. The minute you turn it off, it vanishes, and this just stays the same. So that's a little bit about how that works. Um, just for you Z owners who might be new to the Z car. Kind of different, I guess. I hope that coming up soon with the Nissan, the 400Z, that they change the look of this. I mean, I think it's kind of okay. It's kind of cool, like retro-y looking. But I hope that they change like the clock stuff, you know, not having to click this stuff and have it up here all weird and like I hope they go to digital uh speedometer not this like needle point style that we got going on right here that's what we look like with all that but hopefully they change that so I can't wait to see the new z car um might even eventually own a new z car someday we'll see if it's worth it if I like the body style if the interior is better but once this thing eventually goes downhill in many years to come I might see about getting the Z car if they change it and if not it's all good because the Z heritage to me is wonderful um I just love these cars that's though I am on my second one so anyways guys I hope that this video was helpful for you um who owned the 370Z and how to change your 
clock on the tack there. So thanks again for watching, guys, and I hope you all have a great rest of your day, and happy holidays. Bye, guys.